Welcome back to Spider-Man. So we just, uh, we caught the big bad, but I think we're gonna probably have a Joker Arkham Asylum caught on purpose kind of thing going. That's my, that's my thought on the matter. So let's see, we gotta do a... Let's see. Let's follow up on this uh, tombstone. Okay. Even the mole people living in the sewers know about the high speed chase between police, Spider Man, and the demons. Once again, Spider Man makes a bad situation infinitely worse. And we have a highly intelligent caller who agrees with me. You're on with J. Jonah Jameson. Yes, Mr. Jameson. Yeah, I was trying to get to work, and I was almost run over. Look, I understand that Spider-Man saved the kidnapped victim, and I'm glad about that. But I could have been killed. Not just you. This is the problem with that masked maniac. The police are able to coordinate efforts, block streets, lay down tire shredding strips, because they're a team. Spider-Man is a one-man show who cares about one thing. Spider-Man! And you almost paid for that. With your life! That Spider-Man derangement syndrome. SMDS. Ha! <laughs> a pigeon! Chase is on! While I'm here, I should examine the transmitter MJ found. The last time I was here, I, um, I completed all those puzzles on the, uh, two data pads. Nothing big from it, just a trophy. Trophy and some research points. Where's the good doctor? Doc loves these things. He used them in grad school when he had to manipulate radioactive isotopes. Says seeing them keeps him humble. Take them away. If I can reverse engineer this, it should track Tombstone's shipments. straight lines here.
this way gives, gives us so many straight ones here. Looked like a swastika. That should do it. Time for a test run. Sure, that was accidental. I swear, I one of the ones I did off screen. I swear it did. It was a. It was one okay. square away from the Just gotta follow the signal. Swastika. Should lead to whatever it is Tombstone's moving. Tombstone. This guy's the mother of all headaches. Permeable skin plus zero morals equals bad time. Hope running a chop shop's the worst thing he's up to. Obviously, we will uh, be back when uh, I'm rebooted and back in. It's got to follow the signal. Should lead to whatever it is Tombstone's moving. And we are back post crash. Tombstone. It's the mother of all headaches. Impermeable skin plus zero morals equals bad time. Hope running a chop shop's the worst thing he's up to. That is the. Uh, Actually, haven't had a PlayStation keep crash like this since. Wonder if it's because I'm running it off a. Okay, take two. There, that truck. Out for a Sunday drive?
Biker gang down. Let's see what's in that truck. Oh, he's gonna open it. Uh, chemical containers. But they're scrubbed clean. Looks like they came from the Alchemax plant in Harlem, but what was in them? And that sound means the end of our lightning round. Should head to Alchemax when I get a chance and find out what was in those barrels. Tombstone's up to something. Probably illegal. Definitely dangerous. Okay, I think things are sort of under control. Maybe I should put in some Peter Parker time at the lab. Let's go ahead and uh, follow up on this first. Shelter. That's actually what I've been playing on my phone. Folks, the mastermind of the City Hall bombing has finally been brought to justice, and shockingly, it's philanthropist Martin Luke. Now, I'll discuss in a moment what kind of twisted, Jekyll and Hyde mentality it takes to lead such a double life. But first, a word of caution to everyone celebrating his arrest. Yes, it's good that he's in jail, but look at all the things we didn't know. How long was he a suspect without anyone telling us? How long did he have a deadly biological weapon that could kill us all? Shouldn't we have been told? Evacuated the city? It's not an accident that we weren't given the information we need to protect ourselves and our families. Someone made that decision. Was it the police? The mayor? I know one guilty party for sure, and his initials are Spider-Man. He was right about everything right up until the last sentence there. I imagine we're going to have to go there at some point. There's the Alchemax plant. know what he was building. Building that tank they used. Easier if I stay quiet. Where are all the security guards? This is ghost town. All these chemicals are safe to be around? Safer than being around the boss if we screw up. Shake a freaking leg.
was that sound? Damn. What was that? Check it out. Got him? Another day, another day. Oh, I Pharmacists? The no lab coats thing gave you away. Tombstone's men are down. Now to find out what's in these barrels. Diox 3. Isn't this the chemical Tombstone was exposed to as a kid? What's he doing with it now? That stuff's not for asthma. That is the greatest insult you can do to a biker. Smash up his ride. More dudes, more drugs. Someone's gotta teach these guys about the dangers of peer pressure. feeling those drug inhalers and Diox-3 are related. Should analyze an inhaler to find out what's going on here. All right, what's in you?
Diox 3 plus designer amphetamines. Pretty clever recipe for temporary invulnerability. I'm impressed. And worried. This stuff hits the street and there'll be a huge market for it. With Tombstone as the sole supplier, I think I can synthesize a counter drug. Wonder if there are any lab supplies in that truck. Time for some artisanal science. There. Single dose of the counter drug. Just need to test it out. Find some biker goon to test it on. This seems like a kind of uh, a Zaz mission in the Ark of Games. Let's go ahead and follow this up from the 3500 XP. I'm guessing this is the uh, the end of it. Let's see what the new costume is. Wow, that looks really absolutely hideous. Much respect, Spidey. Now reports are coming in that Martin Lee, along with exhibiting freakish abilities like those of you-know-who, has lately seemed to display almost a split personality. <laughs> this is hogwash, and a clear attempt to evade justice for his crimes. Only a fool would believe that he's Mr. Positive one moment, helping the poor with a smile, then suddenly he's Mr. Negative, blowing up, wait a minute, Mr. Negative. That's gold, Jared, gold, trademark it, that. <laughs> as I was saying, folks, Morton Lee's evil side, or as everyone is now calling him, Mr. Negative has been revealed as the culprit for the City Hall bomb. Time to shut Tombstone down. It's gonna be a Bane boss fight. You can just guess. The angry drug lord drank alone. There's a poem in there somewhere. <laughs> you know better than me. Never was the literary type. How'd you even manage to connect with Martin Lee? I'm top of my game. I don't go knocking. People find me. Days and he wouldn't feel it. Wonder if the counter drug would work on it. Boys, get in here! You remember last time we did this dance? Your luck okay? It hurts when it rains, but otherwise dandy. Sweet of you to ask. Can't use the counter drug till I take out Tombstone's gang. Ah, oh, so flattered. But the exploitation of suffering things. We pause. You need to clear out it. You like my product? Calling it great. You have your marketing department cook that name up? I am the marketing department. Drug in those inhalers only lasts a little while. Gotta strike when it wears off. A good 
dermatologist? No reason. Break up the new gadgets. Want to take a break, would you? Oh, Lonnie, someone's been skipping cardio. He's wearing down. I'm close. I need to start dodging by uh, going to see Take him down. Your crazy drug lord days are done, please. Sure, for now. Hell of a run, though. <laughs> Not quite how I'd describe it. That's new. Too much to hope you'll be taking it easier now that you're, uh, you know, mortal? <laughs> Not a chance. Threat of death just ups the thrill. Hell of a left hook. Can't wait for the rematch. I can. <laughs> I like you. So he's just gonna sit there in the fire. Okay. That works. That guy was voiced by... Uh... Well, that was dramatic. I wonder how long Tombstone's powers will be negated for. Probably not long enough. Good work for now, though, Pete. Hats on the back all around. Have you ever seen a fire burn like that? Chemfire. Guy's voiced by uh, the guy that does bear. Jeez, like, I thought it was just a bike series. shop. A lot of other stuff, too. Nope, can't let you through. So, numerous witnesses saw Spider-Man swinging through Times Square like the glory hound he is, firing webs at electronic billboards and causing them to reboot. Granted, those billboards are an eyesore. In my day, sign painting was an art. 
But the more pressing question is, what was he up to? I have a theory. He is infecting these billboards with a virus so that they will subliminally hypnotize pedestrians. Hypnotize them into what? Into liking Spider-Man! And he's been doing it for years! This is the only plausible explanation for how many fans this menace seems to have! Oh man, he's got... He's got Spider-Man derangement syndrome, the worst case ever. Completely nuts. 